What's up internet? Mike here with another video and this is just a quick video kind of going along the lines with my Z Fold 2 uh, videos and upcoming review. So let's get into it. Alright, so if you have the Z Fold 2 or you're kind of curious to get one, I just want to share some of the accessories that I have for mine. And uh, I wouldn't say they're must-have, but maybe some of them are must-have. But um, these are ones that I definitely recommend. So um, I have the links for some of these. Some of these I may or may not put in the description. I'm not trying to just make a quick buck. I'm just showing you the recommended accessories that I have and that I use with my Z Fold. So starting it out is going to be the actual case. So this is a case from Rinky. And I've tried two other cases, but this is my favorite just because it's the only one that's kind of see-through. And whereas the other ones were all kind of hard plastic, this one um, is more soft. So it's going to have more shock and drop protection. And so far, it stayed on just fine after two weeks. The second accessory I recommend, but obviously... Um, kind of up to your personal preference, but I went ahead and ordered a matte screen protector for the front and the inner. I don't know if you can see it, but it just cuts down on the fingerprints so much. That has been my biggest gripe with this thing is the fingerprints. It's just a fingerprint magnet. So I went ahead and took the plunge and I removed the inner screen protector and put this matte one on. So um, I'll see how it'll hold up durability wise, but I'll Put a link to the ones that I got, but so far it feels so much better than the tacky one that came on it that was just a fingerprint magnet. So moving on, obviously if you have a Z Fold you probably know or you should know that it supports wireless charging and fast wireless charging at that. So this is a GameStop exclusive, but I've got my little Millennium Falcon wireless charging pad. So when you actually plug this in and set the uh, phone on it, the back lights up. So it's not plugged in obviously, so I can't show you, but I leave this on my desk here. It charges the phone pretty dang quickly and it just looks cool. So if you're a fan of Star Wars, um, this is definitely a must have. But again, this is a GameStop exclusive, so you'll have to go to GameStop's website or to their store, but it's like 49 bucks. So next, um, this Microsoft does not make anymore, but this is their folding keyboard. Um, so it doesn't necessarily have to be this keyboard, but I like this cause I'm trying to go for compactness. So I use the keyboard here, which this is probably the longest or oldest piece of tech that I have right now, with the exception of I've got an old Palm Pilot laying around, but I've had this thing for probably five years now and it still works just like the day I got it. But obviously any little keyboard will do, but with the screen being so big on the Z Fold, you've really got a miniature workstation. So with this, you know, if I set it on a uh, stand or tripod, which I'm going to show you, I can use my little foldable keyboard here, which will fit in my bag or tech bag. And then I have the Microsoft Foldy Mouse, which I recommend just because again, it's compact. These fit in your bag, they don't take up any space, and when you don't want to use it, you just make it go straight, and it's not going to be going off in your bag. So that's why I like this. Now the mouse is on, now the mouse is off, so if it's in your bag, you're not getting any false button pushes and things like that. So with that, like I said, I've got my folding keyboard, my mouse, and then this is my favorite accessory out of all the ones on the table here because it fits in my wallet but it is a little stand and it's literally the size of a credit card but this when I was searching Amazon the other day I just happened to stumble upon this and it is just the coolest little stand so let me show you how it works here so it's just got little snaps things here and it's got an adjustable little doohickey here I don't know what the proper term is but Essentially, you can set this at any level you want, and then it holds your phone. So, with your little tripod here that fits in your wallet, you take your mouse and your keyboard, and you've literally got a little micro workstation that all will fit in your pocket. 
So pretty dang cool. Like I said, I think this was $7 on Amazon, but it literally fits in your wallet. So this is honestly my favorite new accessory, you know, because obviously you don't have to use this with just a Z Fold. This will work with any phone or tablet, but I just love how it fits in my wallet. So that's exactly how I carry it. I just put it in my wallet and I leave it there. So next, moving on, is a Xbox controller. Now the cool thing about modern Xbox controllers is you can just Bluetooth connect it direct to your tablet and or Z Fold. So if you use the little stand that I showed you and you carry this in your bag, it's just a great little mobile setting, mobile gaming setup. So um, it's super easy to pair this. I mean, you just put it in pairing mode, you go to your Bluetooth settings in your phone, and bam, you're connected. And there are a ton of games that support this. And if you use the new Microsoft Cloud Gaming, or any cloud gaming for that fact, you can use this. So definitely recommend this for an accessory for the Z Fold, or really any tablet, Android or otherwise. Next is a good set of wireless earbuds. So again, everything on here, I'm trying to keep it where it's compact and it will all fit in my pocket. So I recommend either the Galaxy Buds Live or Pro, which just came out, or probably still my favorite and most comfortable is the Microsoft Surface earbuds. But it doesn't have to be these, but I just really recommend that you have a set of true wireless earbuds with your Z Fold. So, moving on. Well, last but not least, if you've got an Android phone especially, um, and this one of course being the Z Fold 2 with USB Type-C, I recommend this little guy. Now, this is the Samsung T5. You can get Samsung T4 or even a T3 um, cheaper than this, but right now you can get a two terabyte one on Amazon for around 230 bucks. But the cool thing about these and it being USB Type-C is this has a great camera on it. So it takes really good pictures and really good 4K video. And the easiest way to get this off is with a Type-C SSD like this. You just plug it into the bottom of the phone. It recognizes it. And you can literally transfer files back and forth in seconds. So if you go out for a walk, whatever, you're taking some nice video or pictures and you want to get it off so you can put it on your computer, put it on YouTube, whatever. This is really the simplest, most efficient way to get media on or off of your Z Fold. Just plug it in and bam, no drivers necessary. It just reads it and it works. So there you have it. This was just a quick video. I wanted to show you some of my favorite accessories that I've been using with my Z Fold. So I'm curious what your favorite accessories are. What is your go-to kit that you like to carry with your phone? Now, when you've got a phone that turns into a tablet, it just opens up a whole new world, more possibilities, I think, for different, better, more diverse accessories. So those are just the ones that I like to use with the device so far. Now, if I stumble across more, I'll be sure to share it with you guys. But as always, if you've got any questions on any of these products or you want to see me test something on this def on this phone, just shoot it in the comments below. And also, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you're here watching, you might as well subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.